The distributive property expand and simplify each of the following. Now in these four examples we will be applying distributive property twice. As you can see there are two sets of brackets. These are outside sets of brackets, right? These sets of brackets are outside. And then we have a set of bracket inside, which is this one, right? And in such questions, we have to apply the order of operations. So we'll first open the inside brackets and then move out. So this could be expanded as 2x, and then we have outside brackets. Inside we have x plus 5 times x plus 5 times 3, which is 15. So that is how we are going to apply distributive property and expand using distributive property the inside bracket. Now we can combine the like terms. We have got x and 5x which is 6x. So we have 2x, x plus 5 is 6x plus 15. And now let's apply distributive property once again to get our answer. 2x times 6x is 12x squared and 2x times 15 is 30x, right? So that is how they should be solved. Let's do the next one now. In this case, 3x is outside the brackets and that's, this is a big set of brackets, right? That is it. Inside we have x plus 2 times x, which is 2x, 2 times minus 3, which is minus 6. Let's combine the like terms and then move forward. So we have 3x minus 6, if we expand, 3 times 3 is 9, x times x is x squared, minus 6 times 3 is 18x. So that is how we can solve it. You can copy these two questions, right? Solve and check with my answer. So let me give you a quick solution for this. You can do it along with me. It should be 3x. First, we'll do the inside bracket. So we have 2x minus 3 times 3 3x minus times minus is plus, so we get plus 3. Now, we will expand 3 times 2 is 6, x squared. Well, I should have combined these terms, right? So, now let me, let me expand without combining. I should have first combined. It is simpler to combine and expand, right? You will see how. 3 times 3 is 9 with the negative sign, x squared, plus 3 times 3 again, 9x. Now let us combine the like terms. 6x squared minus 9x squared gives us minus 3x squared plus 3x as our answer. If we would have combined, we would have got here x and x times 3x is, I mean minus x, would have given us directly. Okay, let's not forget this time. We have 4a square brackets, 2a minus 9 minus minus plus 3a bracket close. And then we will now combine these terms, 3a and 2a. So we have 4a within brackets. We have 5a minus 9. And let's apply distributive property. Nine, 4 times 5 is 20, a squared, and minus 9 times 4, 36a. So that should be your answer. So that is how we can actually apply distributive property. A couple of times, expand and simplify polynomials. I hope you get the gist of it. Thank you and all the best.